clips we're about to check out the Burgermeister. In the last video, I spent probably close to 20 to 30 euros in the gift shop, which was a bad idea. <laughs> well, I don't know if it was a bad idea, but it was an accidental thing that I did. Anyways, we got to move on. We're going to have to figure out a way to make some cash. Some euros. Oh, look at them playing with dolls. That's adorable. Ooh, what do we have here? What is this? A board game. I like board games. I just actually purchased Settlers of Catan not too long ago. In fact, I'm going to be buying the Ticket to Ride soon, too. What kind of board games do you like? Yeah, I guess we can't go rifling through his stuff while he's in here, right? That'd be kind of rude. Uh, turn, turn, turn. Ooh, what's this? Oh, that's bad. Look at that mess! <laughs> I want you to put everything exactly the way it was. Sorry, I will. I wasn't paying attention. Game guide. Wow, another one of these mini games. Strength, magic, health, wisdom, distance forward slash backwards. Okay. I have to read all this? I don't want to. The donkey king. That's weird. This character has something special drawn here. Which character? These are all based on Grimm's characters. Like the key? Is that the... Hmm. Sailor Redbeard! Whoa! She's quite the breasty one there. Whoa! Tons of things here. So that one's the key, is it? Future card design. That's neat. It looks like I'll need to get the trays to their original levels. <sighs> okay. Um, the this one goes right in the middle. Whoa! Holy crud! Something with high. Oh, I see. It's all math. Who doesn't love math? I'm assuming it's math. So what do we got here? Magic. That's a pretty high magic. This is a hero. I think. Is a rabbit a monster or a hero? Well, pretty close. That is definitely a monster. Yeah, we're keeping it pretty even here. Red. Monster. Monster. Magic. Got it! Okay. Hey, what's that? Grab it before he notices. Carl! Oh, I need to translate this. Nien du has kein an wall du must an ans falsch Yeah, I know, that was very bad. I wonder what these orders he's talking about are. No, you don't have a choice. Follow the orders given to you or else. Alright. Cool, we did that game. That was kind of fun. I wonder if we could do more of it. Hey there, fella. Why do you have a keyboard lane over there? You must be Nancy, yes? Yes. That's right. I'm here to help you take care of the monster sightings. Shh, shh. There is certainly no monster, Fraulein, and there have been no monster sightings. Everything is fine. There is no need for alarm. We have a huge monster problem here, literally and also figuratively. The monster is huge, and it is also a huge problem. I need your help. Why are you doing that? Doing what? Talking so loudly. Who is listening in? I am the Burgermeister, Nancy. If I appear to be scared, how will everyone feel? The last thing I need is the castle newspaper picking up on how bad things are. The castle has its own newspaper? Of course. Doesn't yours? I don't really live in a castle. How do you protect yourself from peasant uprisings? It's never really been an issue. Can you tell me a little bit about this monster? 
What? You want details? It's a monster. It is monstrous. Get rid of it, please. And thank you. <laughs> what do okay. you think of Renata? Did you know that Anya wants her to go? I don't understand why. She's such a great storyteller. This isn't the first time she's come here, you know. Although it was before my time, she knows a lot about this place. Anya told me she likes Renata. I'm pretty sure that's not the case. Maybe she's trying to impress you by pretending to be far friendlier than she actually mm. is. I like your lederhosen. I like your lederhosen. Yes, yes, get it out of your system now, Fraulein. What do you mean? No one likes lederhosen. Look at these! All of these straps and hooks and what have you. It's like I can't be trusted to keep my shirt on. Do you know how long it takes me to put these on in the morning? Nine minutes! And it's not like they look good. I look like a sad old Pinocchio. <sighs> then why do you wear them? It's part of Marcus's Bavarianization of the castle. He wants to give Taurus a more authentic experience when they come here. It sounds like you're not a fan of that idea. I grew up here. I know authentic. If he wanted authentic, he should have come to me instead of stuffing the castle full of idiotic tourists. Uh, no offense to you and your fanny pack wearing loud talking country people. It sounds like you don't like tourists. We have no business having tourists here. It isn't right. Okay. Earlier, you hid some things when I came in. Were they dolls? Yes. Fraulein, these are not dolls. Right. Okay, what are those items? These are injection-molded, professionally crafted, physical, tactical, multi-directional, place-holding avatars. Nope, still don't get it. Therefore, a fully immersive, strategic, map-inclusive campaign tabletop set I've built. Okay, I know those words, but that is the extent of what I took away from that sentence. You Americans would call it a game. Oh, yes, we would call it that. But that is because in the rest of the world, games are not taken seriously. Here, we take games very seriously. Sure very seriously! That is why German board games are the best in the world! <laughs> you know what's funny? I was just talking about uh, Settlers of Catan and uh, Tickets to Ride and them. Fairly confident they're both German board games. <laughs> Let me know if I'm wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure they are. They are? Yes, they are. Just so you know, many of the most popular games throughout the world actually were created in Germany. And now I'm working on creating a new game. When it is done, it's going to turn the strategy world on its ear. Which now that I think about it as an expression, does not make a great deal of sense. Why is that? Because why would it be on its ear? This is preposterous. No, the other thing. Why is this game so important? You'll have to see. Tell me your play. It's not perfect yet, but it's pretty great so far. At least that is what I think. But you should be sure to tell me what you think. Don't be shy. I can always use constructive criticism. Well, I, I personally love board games. Sure, so I'd sure, love to. Not? Great! It's called Raid. The game is very simple. It's just about using the best strategy and, of course, finding the coolest looking character. Ready? I'll play blue if you play the other two colors. Oh, excellent! Alright, we're gonna go easy because I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh... Maybe I should look at the rules. <laughs> For players age 10 plus, each player is dealt three cards randomly. Pick a player to go first. Player spins the spinner and moves their pawn forward the number shown. The color of the square the player lines on determines the next action. Red, challenge with strength. Blue, challenge with magic. Green, challenge with health. Orange, with wisdom. Purple, steal a card. White, move to the next white square. Black, move. Oh, that's kind of cool. Squares with a heart. Player gains a card from the deck. Squares with a flower thing. Players loud up to eight cards. Alright, it's kinda neat. So red. Challenge with Same thing, right? Yeah, go! Yeah, I win, right? 
Do I win his card too? Oh. Alright, spin it. No, you dirty thing. I just saw that. Uh, get rid of this one. How long is this going to take? Oh, it's supposed to do green? Oh, good grief. I'm going to lose big time. This is terrible. Oh, crap. Whatever. Tie! What does a tie do? Oh, we both lose. Red. Am I seriously gonna have to fight all the time? Beautiful. Wow, he's got quite the magic, I think, orange was. I get to take a card. No, you thief. Orange, it looks like. I don't have any good oranges. Crap. Whoa, he freaking sparrowed me. This is bad. So far. Blue. Fight him. Thirteen. Well, that's cool. I choose who I fight. Yeah, I'll take Sailor All Red right. Braid. Orange? Why are they always fighting me? Oh man. That's terrible. Oh, well, they're actually fighting each other for a change? It's the Donkey King. I'm not sure how long this is going to take, but this is kind of a neat little board game. I'm not sure what the difference is here. Three. White. I go all the way to the next white one. Yeah, it takes the lead. No, you dirty thing. No. Oh, he picked me. Crap. Crap, crap, crap. Terrible. I want to win. I don't like losing. I'm a poor loser. Ooh, heart. I'll go with this guy. Green. This one. Come on, come on. My turn to win. Yeah. Corn canoer. Red. I will right, go. Go big or go home. Yes. Why would he do red with that guy? Maybe he didn't have a choice. Huh. Loses a card. Yeah, you two can go fight amongst yourselves. Oh, it would have been great if you'd fell in the black one. Or brown one, whatever color that is. No, not my... No! Oh, orange. Uh, I'm gonna go with... I mean, how... Do this one. What are the chances he has one higher? We tie! Sweet. Oh, 
Nobody goes anywhere. Alright. Fairy trigger. Wow, I think the yellow one's gonna win. All the way around, yay! Too little, too late. Tie again. Yellow wins. Nice round. What did you think? I actually loved it. I loved it. Ha! <laughs> I knew it. I said to myself. Carl, this is the one. This is a game that's going to put you on the map. Here, take this for your trouble. Take what? Thanks. A bag of money. Who's Lucas? Lucas is the castle's other monster. What do you mean? He's the head of security's son, so he's always wandering around, meddling, talking, endlessly talking, chattering away about some inane thing. It never ends with that one. How could someone who knows so little talk so much? The talking is more annoying than all of the pranks. Pranks. This thing, what is it? Why does everyone just call it the monster? Honestly, there is not much we know about it. What do you mean? Most of us have only seen the destruction it leaves behind. But it still seems like you would know enough about it to at least give it a name. After all this time? I heard it had a name long, long ago. The villagers, hundreds and hundreds of years ago, they knew the monster. They would leave food for him deep in the woods. They were all terrified of him, of course, but so were the wolves. If they kept the monster fed, he would not bother them, and they could raise their livestock in peace. But one night, the monster broke into the castle and kidnapped the Freiherr's only daughter. He was broken-hearted and decreed that the monster be killed on sight. He demanded that the townsfolk no longer leave food in the woods. It was forbidden to speak the monster's name in town. Sure. Was his daughter ever found? Interesting. No one knows. No one even knows how true the story is. It was a long time ago. But there are many stories like it that happened in these walls. Can you catch me up on what's been happening with these monster sightings? The castle is emptying out. I've never seen people be this nervous. You've got to get to the bottom of this quickly. What has happened with the monster so far? I don't know. I've heard all sorts of things. Magda saw him out in the woods last week. She was out gathering herbs. After a rainstorm, she drops her basket, and when she looked back up, she saw him standing there. She was sure she was going to get it, but the monster just walked away. Where is Magda? Can I talk to her? You can try, but good luck with that. She's bolted her door and she hasn't come out since that night. Come to think of it, you should leave her alone. What? No. I just want to ask her a few questions. I know exactly what you want to do, and I'm telling you that you need to leave mm. her alone. I don't know if I'm going to do that. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. Wow, that was a lot of fun. Not sure what we need to do here. Well, yeah, we tried to get into that already. Oh, yeah, we looked this at this looks bird. just like the picture in the raid guide. There must be something special about this painting. Ooh, a key. What a strange place to keep a key. Hopefully he doesn't mind me stealing that key. What kind of key is it for? Antique key. Hmm. Nothing here. What else is there to do in here before I leave? 
We knocked those down already. Hmm. We looked at that already. Okay. Turn, 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 turn. I keep doing the same thing. Crap. Okay, well, I think what we'll do here, uh, once we find Car Carl, where is he? Where the hell is he? There we go. We'll pause here, and we'll see you in the next Nancy Drew video. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye for now.